Unleash the lizard. Do it. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> there, I just marked my I marked my territory. What's up, my doomed friends? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Last Day on Earth Survival. All right, as you can see here, I have done some work off camera. Last video, we went exploring. This video, I'm going to spend some skill points, build up my base, and go out and do some more exploring. If you enjoyed the video, please remember to give it a like. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. So, first things first, let's go over all your wonderful, wonderful tips, okay? First of all, some people are saying that you can make the motorcycle. Some people are saying you can't make the motorcycle. I don't know what the deal is. Maybe you can make it. Maybe you can't. We'll see. Uh, also, people said you can move stuff around. You can move your... Uh, your furniture around by going to the furniture tab and then clicking on the item and then choosing this thing and then you can move your furniture around so i'm going to move this right over here just for the walls kind of spin it around put it right there looks good and there we go all right thank you very much for that that was that's really helpful as you can see i moved the crafting table over here uh, maybe i should put some stuff in there eh, whatever let's not worry about that right now uh also you guys told me i should be sneaking up on the zeds more often and um the way you sneak up on the zeds you sneak up to them from behind and then you can actually, like, one-shot them sometimes, depending on how good of a weapon you have. Um, what else? What else? What else? Okay, uh, double-click double, double click for fast moving. So you can see right here, double-click, 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 double-click. Thank you very much. Extremely helpful. And there's an extra inventory slot I didn't notice here, and you can put stuff in there. Like, um, i got to remember not to press escape. Um, you can put stuff in that inventory spot. Like, uh, let's say you got some food with you, and you want to put that in the inventory spot. You just drag it down here below your bag. And now it shows up right here. So you can go ahead and eat it from, from here. Am I hungry? Yes, I am. So say if I wanted to eat on the run, boom, I went ahead and ate. Now, that's mostly going to be used for healing items, I'd imagine. But um, it's still a really nice uh, thing to have. Now, I did do some farming off camera. And as you can see, I made some more chests. I moved some stuff around. Let me show you what I've got so far. There's all my food. All right, that's my food chest. This is my tool chest, weapons chest. I have all my weapons on me because we're going to kind of go through them in a minute. Uh, this is my uh, wood stone and uh what is this thing a uh, plant fiber chest so there you go i did i did a little bit of farming with some wood and some stone and then right here is my i don't know what this is right now it's just a miscellaneous ch chest um and then this one's also a miscellaneous chest at the moment all right so that's all the stuff i have if you were interested go go back and pause the video for, to see any one of those all right so let's see what we got i did get an airdrop off camera and the major thing I got in that airdrop was this, this bad boy right here. The Spiked Devastator. Okay. So let's take a look at these weapons, okay? This one is a 10-1. This one... Don't forget, as attack speed... As the number for attack speed goes up, that means you're faster. So, you know. Um, so that's uh, 8, 1.7. So that's actually better than this, I'll bet. Because the attack speed so much quicker. This is 31.3. That might be my best weapon, I think. This one is 17, 1.4. And this one is 27, 1.3. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my machete is my best weapon. So that is really cool. We're not going to be doing some hardcore fighting today. So I'm going to put a, a lot of this stuff away. Not in my food chest, though. In my tools chest. So let's go ahead and put some of this stuff away. Maybe I'll hold something as a backup. Um, this machete is... The freaking cleaver is almost done. Uh, I'll hold that as a backup. Why not? Okay, so let's do some building. I do want to build out this base. So this part right here is going to be an entranceway for the base, all right? Then I'm going to have a way over here that's going to hold some crafting stations. Um, this room is going to hold the, what is that, the workbench? It's going to hold the workbench. Probably, I'll probably put about three spots for workbenches in here. This is obviously going to be for uh, storage. I'm not going to keep storage on this wall. I'm going to keep it all along this wall. Okay, so that's the basic idea I have for the build. Let's go ahead and grab our wooden stone and go ahead and build some. Actually, before we do that, let's go ahead and spend some points here. Now, where do I want to put my points and why? Well, we're definitely going to need a melting furnace. That's that's not even up for debate. Uh, we're definitely going to need that. Okay, I think we're also going to want the makeshift bat, although I don't have any duct tape. So if I don't have any duct tape, there's no point in putting points in that yet. So whatever. The rain catch. Okay. Um, wait, can you make the chopper or not? Ooh, that's a good that's a good question because if I spend points on it and I can't make I have what I need to make the chopper. Uh, allows you to assemble a chopper. I have what I need to make the chopper. Can you make it or not? I might have to I might look at that in between cuts because I want to know because I I'm pretty sure I have all the stuff I need for it. So all right, the rain catch is probably going to be important. I think we're gonna I think we're gonna probably learn the rain catch. We've got three points left. Uh, we can't make the bat yet, so that's pointless. We need some duct tape. So I think the rain catch. Sure, let's go ahead and learn the rain catch. I don't know if the CB radio is used yet. I'm gonna do some. I'm gonna do some 
uh, looking into this stuff. Because this game isn't beta. A lot of this stuff isn't used yet. And like I said, people have told me you can use the chopper. People told me you can't use the chopper. So I'm not really sure. I want to know before I spend two points in it. All right. So let's go ahead and make the uh, melting furnace. Oh, I guess we should have stayed in there to make the melting furnace. There we go. Uh, melting furnace, we need the stone and the iron. All right, so let's, let's just grab all our stone and all our wood. There we go. We might not have enough uh, plant fibers to do a lot of this stuff. All right, there we go. We got the iron. And let's go ahead and make the furnace. All right, so I want to put the furnace in a different part of the, of the base. So I'm thinking like over here. So what we're going to do is we're going to tear out this wall. Yes, delete the wall. And then we're going to go ahead and make a... How did I do it over here? Yeah, I kind of did this pretty weird, right? <laughs> um, okay, so we're going to do this just like on the ground. That's like that. And then we're going to have... Uh, maybe we'll have another storage stuff going this way. But this goes up. So this goes like this. And then like this. I'm just trying to match what I did in the other, on the other part of the base. Alright, so this comes over here. So that's going to be an open... Okay, so this is wall, wall... No, door. Wall... This is a wall. Yes. Okay, so no door goes up. So let's go ahead and uh, put a door here. And a door here. And then this is supposed to be a wall to match the other side. Right? Door, door, wall. That is correct. Well, actually, it's supposed to be a window. We can, uh, we can mess around with that later. I think we put down an extra floorboard here that we didn't need to. Okay, so this is going to come down here. That's This is going to be another storage area. So I think I'll have two storage areas. Maybe I'll just make... I'll cut this one here. I'll put four boxes on this side, four boxes on the other side. Maybe I'll do something like that. All right, so this is going to come in here, and this is going to go up and then over two. And then we're going to put down the, this thing right here. There we go. All right, so let's see what we do with this bad boy. Okay, so recipes. Okay, here we go. Iron bar, iron bar... Steel bar, Titan bar, and tungsten bar. Okay, so we could do a bunch of bars here. Um, we want to hold some of this iron because I don't think you want to do all bars, right? Because we might need iron for other things. Uh, and there's actually use for these this raw iron. So I think that'll be pretty good right there. Uh, let's split this. Let's do this. Uh, split. I don't want to put two in there. I don't want to use any more wood than I have to. All right, that looks good. That thing's going. That looks nice. All right, what else did we learn? We learned the rain catch. So we're going to need, uh, what is this, fabric, piece of cloth, and two scrap iron. Piece of cloth and two scrap iron. I do believe we have that. Well, wherever the scrap iron is. There we go. All right, so let's go ahead and make the rain catch. I'll put the rain catch outside. Um, I'm going to put another farm down, probably right here. Probably right here. So I think the rain catch could go over here maybe. All right, let's go ahead and make the rain catch. All right, we're going to go ahead and craft the rain catch. We'll be drinking, people. We be drinking. All right, and I'm assuming that thing will just... Uh, oh, add workers recipe. Oh, okay, so you put the, that's where you put the plastic bottles. Okay, let's do that. Let's go get those plastic bottles. I don't know how long it's going to take. It's probably going to take a while, but who cares? I mean, it, it just works without you being there. That's the that's beautiful part about rain catches, you know? You just go about and do your business and just let the rain catch do its thing. Ten minutes? Wow, that doesn't seem like that long. Hmm. I'm not, I mean, I'm not complaining. <laughs> I'm just saying. All right. So let's go ahead and... Should we build out... Yeah, let's build out whatever else we need here. And uh, let's build out until we can't build no more. And I think then we'll go on some adventures. How does that sound? We'll go see what's going on. I did get an airdrop. Um, I don't like getting airdrops off camera, but I'm probably going to do a good amount of farming off camera. So I think it's something we need to get used to. Okay. Uh, yes, we need wood and stone. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this stuff away. And let's go out and look for some trouble. All right, guys. We actually do have a really bad food shortage right now. Um, oh, wait. No, we don't. It's because I put them in here. Okay. I was like, where did all my food go? All right, well, whatever. I'll keep it in there, I guess. I was like, man, I really got no food. I actually, we do not have a lot of food. And I have a lot of food to cook, but the reason I can't I can't cook it, um, and the reason I can't cook the food is because, now well, it's simple. I don't have any wood. So, all right, let's throw that in there. Let's go ahead and use one of these. And then let's go ahead and get rid of this. Don't want to bring any... Damn it. Stop hitting escape key. We don't want to bring any... Uh, 
We don't want to bring anything with us. I am going to bring the uh, the hatchet because I do want to get some wood. But uh, we're really going out for loot, guys. This is mostly for loot. If, it's going, if we're going out for loot, maybe we should take a better item. All right. I'm going to take a better weapon because, since we're going out for loot. Um, I might have to deal with some zombies. So let's, let's just bring the big boy out. Why not? Uh, nah, let's not. Let's bring out the hammer. Stop! Hammer time! Okay. Can we bring this down there? No, we can't. Okay, so we can, we can do this. Alright, well, let's just hold on to this. If we find any really if we find any really crazy, badass zombies, we will switch to the hammer. For now, we'll just use this. We'll use the spear. Uh, I, I want to use, I wanna use uh, some stealth tactics to kind of... Uh, by the way, the, this is the horde. It's, it's never anywhere near me. I don't really know what the deal is with that. Alright, so it doesn't look like we have anything special out here. So, this one, maybe we might want to try. What do you think? Bunk, bunker Alpha? Let's go for it. Now, I don't have any good gear, honestly. I've got, like, a decent... I probably should have brought my good weapon. But uh, we're going to go here. We're going to be careful. You know, we're, we're just... We're not going to get in any trouble, hopefully. Knock on wood. But we'll see. That doesn't really work because my desk isn't made out of wood. But what are you going to do? All right, here we are, guys. Wish me luck. Let's check out Bunker Alpha. Some semblance of an army still functions today. Sometimes... Uh, you can spot a helicopter. Okay. Um, all right. Let's just let's just take a look around. All right. So we got a corpse over there, which is weird. Uh, I don't know who killed that guy. Okay. Nothing. Oh, here we go. There we go. I don't want to use that gun. I don't think so. Does it have any bullets in it? Does it say damage twenty, attack speed? Is there bullets in the game? You know what? I wonder if there's bullets in the game. Because I don't see anything for bullets here. Well, whatever. I'm going to use a gun just because I want to. Alright, so I'm guessing there's nothing out here then. This is just... You need that key card to get in. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything out here. Let's just take a quick look around though. You never know. Alright, we got some trees over here. Actually, sure. Let's get some wood. That's what we're doing here, right? We get a couple of trees here. That'll be nice. Alright, level up. Level 9. That doesn't mean anything though. We need level 10. All right, so, all right, tool's broken. Fair enough. Let's go on over here. I don't even know how to shoot the gun, to be honest. It should be pretty... There's a lot of trees over here, man. Damn. You come to a freaking bunker thinking you're going to go get loot, and there's like a million trees. That's awesome. I have to come back here for trees. And there's no zombies out here, which is incredible. Yeah, like, I was trying to cut down trees off camera, and there were zombies everywhere. It was annoying. So, that's pretty interesting. All right, let's go in this place. Let's see what's going on. Uh, can we go in here, actually? No. Yeah, you gotta go towards that green door. Okay. Um, insert the card. Yes, sir. Open. Oh, boy, what is this? Looks like a big gear or something we gotta turn. We need some loot here. Oh, cool. So we got some uncontested loot. It doesn't look like this is a big uh, bunker either. It looks like very small. Oh, my God. Well, okay. Well, okay, then. Um, yeah, that's. I'll take that. Can we double-click this stuff? No, we can't. You can probably go down to equipped, but it's just as quick to do this. What is this gear, anyway? This is tactical body armor. This is the best stuff in the game, isn't it? Although it's all almost broken. I got another gun, too. Yeah, I'm starting to think that there's no... um. I'm starting to think there's no bullet. There's no ammo in the game. But I don't really know, and I probably won't until I shoot a zombie. Okay, so that's nice. What we got here is some bandages. And uh, we got some water, some food, some health kits. Bandages heal you for 40. Health kits heal you for 100. Man, this is... This is inc Why is this so easy? How come there's no zombies here? This is kind of weird, right? Like, I wouldn't think this would be. this should be this easy. I mean, I'm not really complaining. Maybe maybe you're supposed to be able to come here and get this stuff. I, I don't know. I really don't know. All right, we got no more room. Let's just look what's in here. And I think we're going to head home. <laughs> Man, there's nothing here. I can't carry any of that stuff. Can we do anything over here? Nah, nothing. What is this? All right, I should, probably shouldn't hit that. Yeah, whatever. Enter password. Unlock the vault door. Oh, Okay. Is it 848? I didn't think so. Okay, guys. Just dropped a bunch of stuff off. And check this out. We have an airdrop. So this is going to be rough. I think the airdrop might be the last... We can either go to the airdrop or 
the bunker. I don't think we can go to both. That's a tough call. I think, oh man, that's a really tough call. I think we're going to have to go to the bunker though. I've gotten a lot of airdrops before. Um, although I don't know if there's any more to that bunker though, because I don't know the key code. So, but there's still a few, there's still a lot of stuff in the uh, bunker. I couldn't get out. So, ah, that's a bummer. I'm probably gonna have to wait another 15 minutes. It, the airdrop won't be there again. So actually the airdrop probably would have been the correct choice, but whatever. Let's check out the bunker. See what we can see. What I'll do is I'll uh, pause the video and look it up. See if I can find the key code. Um, uh, be, you know, in between cuts. Okay. Let me clear this place out. Well, that, that's a really good bunch of loot right there already. Probably better than what we got at the airdrop. I mean, I've gotten airdrops. They, didn't, they weren't, like, always great, you know? Okay. Let's go right here. Take that. Take that. All right, key code. That I do not know. Give me one minute. All right, guys. I decided to walk to the forest. All right, this trip took about it took about sixteen minutes. I think we're gonna speed up the rest. And there we are. Finally, got to the forest. Man, what a pain in the butt. So yeah, you gotta be really careful with your with your stamina, especially me as a YouTuber. I gotta be careful. By the way, I'm starting to smell. Um, especially me as a YouTuber, I have to uh, be careful because if it's not close to the end of the video, then, you know. All right, let's see if we can clap. Now, I'm, I think as I'm smelling, this might be a little bit more difficult. I, I'm not going to use a gun on these guys. Uh, now, honestly, I kind of want to use my, my crappy items, but um, I'm going to Actually, which is worse? The crowbar? 17, 1.7, 1.6. So the crowbar is definitely better. So I'm going to go ahead and use the hammer for now. And um, I didn't really want to use my good items on these, like, wimpy zombies, but... Alright, well, that didn't work. That's okay. We're good. We will just club this zombie in his freaking stupid zombie head, and we're good to go. Alright. So let's, uh, let's try and sneak up on this one. Let's try and sneak up on this zombie. So I tried sneaking in the past, but it didn't work. Oh, never mind, it's not a zombie. Look, can I sneak up on the wolf? Apparently I can. Alright, so it looks like we got some sneak damage there. I tried sneaking earlier in the game, like when I first got it, but I, you know, ran right up to a zombie's face. It's all the wolves. I ran right up to a zombie's face and smacked him, and of course he saw me, so it didn't really work. But I, I didn't think, yeah, I'd walk up behind him, Cage. Obviously, you gotta be a, a sneaky, sneaky ninja. Wait, here we go. Here we go. Say goodnight. Yeah! This ninja's just been uncaged. Hell yeah. Alright, well that's good. We got rope. Big effing deal. We care about rope. I mean, I don't know if you know what we need rope for, but we get a lot of it. It's like uh, it's like our major drop in the game. Alright, well, actually, I just got my third duct tape. So that is really nice. Did you see that? Alright, so I definitely couldn't get every... Ooh, gold watch. What is that good for? Status symbol. Okay, now it can be used as spare parts. Is there anything I want to keep here? By the way, um, in order to get into that alpha bunker, like you need to be like level 15 or something. You need to repair this phone, and you need to find a flash drive to put into the phone. So, all right, I really want to take that with me. Let's just leave this here. There we go. Um, actually, can we put these in here? How many can you fit? Four? Good. It does stack. There we go. We can take everything. All right, so oh, he's got something on him. Rope. More, more precious, precious rope. All right. Um, unfortunately, I, you know what, we have to make room, we have to make room for cloth, uh, not cloth, but we have to make room for plant fibers, because I actually do need plant fibers, I, I, I don't think I have any at home, actually, um, so what can I get rid of here, we can eat, yeah, let's eat, oh god, I didn't think that would give me so much, alright, let's overeat, <laughs> the hell with it, I don't know if overeating is a bad thing, or I know it is in real life, but I don't know about it in the game, alright, so let's be a sneaky, sneaky ninja, oh, never mind, Kid Rock wants to dance. Suck it, Kid Rock! I don't even like your music. Actually, that's not really true. I like Kid Rock. There we go. What do you got? Oh my god, he got a lot of stuff. Well, I got that. Um, he's got... Actually, he's got crap. He's really got crap. I don't think I want to... Get rid of this. I'm going to take the spear because I actually do not want to use this hammer up. I mean, these guys here are weak sauce and I don't need to be using my good items here. Um, I actually want to take a lot of this stuff, but I, I don't want to get rid of anything. I guess rope is rope is probably very useful. But the fact that... Oh, God. Never mind. Um, 
All right, forget it. We're not here to get wood. Let's hold on to the rope. Actually, let's let's keep let's leave the rope here and take this. Okay. Alrighty. Oh, there we go. You saw me. There we go. Give you the smackdown of a lifetime. Uh, let's come up here. These two are. Oh boy, we got a running zombie. Well, doesn't matter. We got to fight him anyway. All right. Can we heal up instantly? Yes, we can. All right, good. All right, that's fine. I wish I could tell a shower makes sense. Yeah. I, I wish I could tell how tough the zombie is before I get close, right? Like, I can't tell. Oh, I guess I could tell if I sneak up to him. Can I see him? All right, guys, this is a roaming zombie. He should be pretty easy to kill. I don't know what the point of uh, worrying about my smell is when it doesn't seem to matter. What is this one? All right, I think we should get some good items before we go in on this. This could get hairy. I'm going to fight it because I want to I want to level up. So, All right, here we go, guys. Wish me luck. Okay, fast spider. Okay. Yeah, smoked him. Hells yeah. Hells yeah. All right, well, let's just uh, keep farming experience. Why not? I can't carry anymore, and I can't go home. Okay, you guys got destroyed. Okay. Let's come up here. Oh, something's, something's following me. You want a piece? Oh, got a player. Not good. Now, he's got an actual player name. That well, doesn't matter. I healed through it. Now, I, I I know there's not actual players in the game. Man, this sucks, man. I'm losing so much loot, though. Let's take the iron. I really don't need that much meat. Uh, let's take that. Okay. <laughs> no, attack the wolf, you dumbass. <laughs> he tried to attack the deer. What a screw-up. All right, let's see what we got in here. More loot I can't carry. <laughs> Oh, boy. All right, well, I can take that. Uh, shut up, timer. Uh, I don't care too much about any of that. I kind of want to take this. I kind of want to take that wire. Uh, but I also want that as well. What are these? Rubber parts. Probably rubber parts seem pretty interesting. Can we use this? Yes, we can. Use that. Nope, I can't use that. Maybe I'm full. I don't know. Uh, want to drink some beer? Yeah, let's drink some beer. Why not? Can't drink any beer. Okay. Fair enough. Is there anything I want to leave? I want to leave here. Let's leave this right here. And I wonder how important these ball bearings are. They're probably pretty important, I would think. Oh, I, they stack. Cool. All right, that'll work. Take all. Just make sure make sure anything can't stack. Oh, I got to pee. Go ahead, man. Unleash the lizard. Do it. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> there. I just marked my. I marked my territory. I marked my loot. <laughs> Oh, stay classy, game. Stay classy. All right, let's just, let's just keep killing some more stuff. Okay. Nope. I'm not as uh, I'm not as slick as I thought I was. So what I'm gonna do now is, guys, I'm gonna kill some more zombies for you guys, and then after that, I am going to call it a video, and then I'm gonna collect all this fiber, uh, plant fiber, and then go home. Man, this game is so freaking fun, though. Oh, that didn't work. Okay, this thing's gonna break soon. It's okay though. It should last the rest of the time. Oh, got a player. All right, all right, Tony Stark, I'm out of here. Come on, attack the player. Man, this guy's right on me. Sucks to be you, pal. Sucks to be you. Now let's see if I go back. If he'll still be there. Um, I only have two energy, so I'm definitely gonna have to walk home off camera. So let's go back and see if he's still there. Come on. Come on. All right, I don't see him. All right, so this thing's pretty much toast. Uh, what do I do? I already used all my health packs. All right, you know what? I think I'm going to stick with this weapon. I do not have any more healing items, though. So we have to be aware of that. All right, guys, you know what? I'm just going to call this one here. If I get attacked again, I'm just going to run home. 
Um, not really that concerned. All right, so um, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time, and until then, take it easy.